Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews and today I've got another episode of Candyland and this is really Candyland because <laughs> straight up candy and this one's a little different because it's gonna be for it's gonna be specifically for Halloween time and I don't know this one is going to be different I don't know how this is gonna work how this, if I'm going to survive or not, I don't know. But you know Halloween time's coming up. They have a lot of different items out there. A lot of different things. And this one, no exception. I found this at 7-Eleven. Uh, um, I heard they were coming out. I didn't know anything about them. And we will find out. <laughs> and hopefully it's not too scary. This is... Zombie Skittles it says beware and what this is is regular Skittles but it says most taste delicious but some taste like rotten zombie dare to try bite-sized candies and 110 calories for uh, 27 pieces I don't think I'm going to try 27 pieces, but whatever. So, it says, beware, a rotten zombie taste can be hiding under any of these colors. So, there's all these different colors here. And you can see, and some of them are going to have rotten zombies. Kind of like the Jelly Belly, the um, Bean Boozled Challenge. And this color, the flavors on this one are as follows. Mummified melon, terrifying citrus, oh, terrifying citrus punch, it's kind of hard because they're like circled around it here, chilling black cherry, what is this, boogeyman blueberry and blood red berry, all the different flavors, colors, and some of these are not going to have that flavor. They're going to have a rotten zombie. Okay, here we go. Let's see if I can... Uh, hopefully I won't find one right off the bat anyway. I am going to try and find the different flavors. All the different colors, all the different flavors. I hope if I open it a little more. So... Uh, hopefully this rainbow won't be really bad. All right, this is orange. This one is going to be terrifying citrus punch. <laughs> As you can see, it's orange. And I'll, I'll just go through the other flavors. Here's one's um, chilling black cherry. I think that's what... Yeah. Jumper. Chilling black cherry. So, what else do we got? This is the melon. I'm a fine melon. And now, see, now, I think I might see notice that some of these are a little bit lighter in color. And, and this one is, oh, this is red. Blood red. Boogeyman, I guess. I don't know. Blood Red Berry. And this is the Blueberry one. Boogeyman Blueberry. And they're supposed to have a... I guess that's purple. That one's purple. Those are all the colors. Now, <laughs> uh, I'll try this Boogeyman Blueberry. Now, hopefully it won't taste like a zombie. Here we go. 
<sighs> okay, that's definitely blueberry. Definitely blueberry, it's not bad. A little bit heavy on the blue, but pretty good. Okay. This one is going to be terrifying citrus twist. Hopefully. All right, here we go. <laughs> okay, so far. That is... That is citrus, okay. That is orange. Okay. Now this one... Mummified melon. Man... Okay, that is melon. So far, so good. I like that flavor. That's really good, strong melon. Okay, this is going to be great. Chilling black cherry. <sighs> this is like Russian roulette with candy. <laughs> All right, one more time. Okay, I like that, very intense. Very black cherry. And this one is blood red. I think there's a blood red berry. Looks more um, pink on the, color, on the cover. But, all right. Okay, I'm not sure. I think that is blood red. It could be zombie, I don't know. Very subtle flavor. <sighs> One, just to see. That's green, yeah. Okay, on again. In a hole. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh man. Oh. Oh. Okay. Just my luck. Rotten the zombie. It's kind of like. I don't. I don't think that's very. It's kind of, um, I don't know. That one was Rotten Zombie. All right. I found it. It's nasty. Oh, my God. Oh. That was, okay, I found the Rotten Zombie. Trust me, folks, you don't want to try it. It's kind of like a, yeah, it's like rotten meat. Um, uh, kind of like. You know, day old meat that's been sitting around. It's very, very nasty. <laughs> I can't finish that one. I'm putting it away. That was nasty. Good thing is, there's only one rotten zombie flavor in here. There's not multiple nasty flavors. That was nasty. The other flavors are good. <laughs> And so, um, I did find one. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to get these again. I'll probably, I don't know about finishing these off. I'm going to have to kind of, hopefully I won't, uh, you know, I bite into them. And then if it's nasty, I'll throw it out. <laughs> but the other flavors are good. I 
kind of like the novelty, kind of like the mystery that you're going to get Rotten Zombie. This would be something you can play a prank on somebody, you know, just give them some Skittles and say, here you go, give them a try, and then maybe they'll grab a handful and, you know, one of them's going to be Rotten Zombie in there. I don't know. But for this one, the flavors of all the other ones were good. The novelty is there. The danger is there. It's for Halloween. So for this one, the Skittles Zombie, I give that an 8, 8 out of 11. I mean, the flavors are good. The Rotten Zombie is horrible. And it's just perfect for the Halloween theme. So if you're brave enough, try it. Pick up a bag. And hopefully you won't get the Rotten Zombie like I did. Fortunately, I tried all the other flavors before I got to that one. And it's definitely nasty. So if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell, and that way you won't miss any future content, or if I go live, you will not miss the fun. And like I said, I do not want to try these again. They can keep their rotten zombies to themselves. <laughs> I'll stick with the regular Skittles or the dark side or the bright side or berry mix or whatever different ones they have, or just the originals. So, till next time. On Drew's Food Reviews, when I will be trying something new and hopefully not rotten zombie for you guys, I am putting these away and I don't think I'm going to try them again. I want to press my luck. So until next time, I'll talk to you guys later.